So we chose to use SD-WAN 2.0 because uh, our company is rapidly growing and we're using both public and private cloud. And SD-WAN 2.0 allows us to connect to both public and private cloud with the same platform and have that standardized uh, device across all of our sites. Currently, our network has a little over 300,000 devices connected to it, uh, but we're, we're growing, so I'm sure that number will increase along with as we uh, adopt, more I adopt more IoT uh, devices, I'm sure that number will increase. Network security is critical for healthcare today. Um, actually identifying devices, uh, medical devices, as they're brought onto the network and understanding what they need to communicate with and what they don't need to communicate with is critical uh, when securing your network. For denial of service attacks, we've taken preventative me measures to prepare the network so that it's ready. We have had some denial of service attacks, but so far we've been able to mitigate them. Uh, automation is really important to uh, a network strategy for UPMC because it lets us uh, make changes faster and it reduces the amount of human error. Uh, and automation also makes everything standardized so it's easier to support. Healthcare has a lot of regulatory compliance to, to deal with. Um, lately, it seems like a lot of the regulators want us to have more segmentation on the network to segment uh, medical devices off uh, from one another. It's a challenge to meet regula regulatory demands based on the limited budgets that we have. The network always has to be able to support business critical apps. Uh, so picking a solution that allows you to prioritize the critical apps over internet browsing is very important. Because of the performance of our network, um, we've been able to roll out things like a vendor, vendor neutral imaging system uh, that centrally we can store all of the medical images that we have. Um, we've also been able to roll out uh, genomic uh, sequencing and use a HPC cluster to uh, sequence DNA and change patient outcomes based on the results of, of that.